Its stars like Taina Mula are Brazil's A-list celebrities. I think that Brazil, uh, Brazilians know how to do a novella, like knows how to play soccer. <laughs> it's something really natural for us. I grew up watching the novellas, now I do the novellas. So it's very, it's something very natural. With 40 million viewers every night, she's also got used to an intrigued public scrutinizing her every move. They want to sometimes dress like us, sometimes do the same hairstyle, same makeup. Uh, some, they, they pay attention to everything, even in the uh, color of our nails. <laughs> and they call to Globo and ask uh, which brand we are using. So uh, there is a lot of responsibility. All Brazilian soap operas follow some key plot formulas, dramatic it's a way to unify Brazil because of that. It's, so, it's a huge country with a lot of uh, different cultures inside the same country. So I think that the novellas, through the novellas, people can identify themselves as Brazilians, even uh, living really far away from each other. For example, in Russia, there is a fan club, big, huge fan club of these characters and they uh, watch by internet uh, th all the scenes of our characters and they write for the Brazilian newspaper asking for more scenes and something like that. This is very unique for me. I, I didn't, I haven't experienced this kind of feedback. Yeah. Feedback. 